You're on tour with the Australian cricket team on cricket.com.au, the home of Australian cricket online. Hi, it's Nathan Bracken here, and as you can see, we're at the the Theatre of Dreams, and and yeah, so we had a we had a very quiet time here a couple of nights ago watching a game which was very close to some of the guys' hearts and and not so close to others. But to have the I guess to have the opportunity to come here and watch watch a massive game as as Manchester United versus Arsenal. A um, little bit of controversy seeing the coach getting ejected and, and quite entertaining actually seeing him jumping up and standing above the, one of the tunnels there. But to come here and, and to witness such a sporting event on such a stage, um, to be at probably one of the biggest sporting events in Manchester and, and probably one of the biggest ones around England and to have the opportunity to see it here, see some of the superstars go around, it was was an amazing thing. And, and I know all the boys, we, we sat up there, loved every minute of it. Uh, I think a few of us wish we could actually get out there and have a little run around. So I know after the game we came down and, and had a walk around the ground to leave and, and sort of got that close. You could actually touch the outfield and, and just sort of see it. And, and it was amazing to to witness it, to witness the slope of the ground. So I sat there watching on TV at home. You, you don't realise how high it's actually elevated and the, and the actual slope of the ground as it runs across. But an amazing thing. And the funny thing is we're, we're probably doing more of the, well, I know myself at the moment, doing more of the sightseeing things than I'm actually playing cricket. And um, hopefully that'll change in a couple of days. We've had a 2020 game washed out the other night. Uh, big game for us tonight. Hopefully we can get out there and, and put a good performance forward. It's a second 2020 game night game here. At the moment we're looking, it's, it was bright and sunny, but now we've got a few clouds in the sky. So hopefully it hangs out there and, and we can put on a good show. Um, yeah, there's a bit of pressure on us to, to make sure, especially after the Ashes and, and how that sort of ended for us, to make sure we start the one day in 2020 series on a winning note. Uh, and then we head to head to London. So we start there with with a one day at the Oval and I think we head to Lords after that. So it'll be a, it's a big week for us. Uh, I guess tonight's a, the night where we kick it off and, and make sure we get going right and, and perform well and hopefully carry that momentum through and, and get a good start. And, and yeah, hopefully we can have a, a good result. So... Um, I'll just give you a chance to enjoy the, the lovely view here and, and I know our physio and, and Mike Hussey enjoyed it immensely um, sitting here watching watching their favourite team and, and for them they got the right results. So, um, but yeah, I think for, for sports people it's something if you look at, it's one of the traditional stadiums that's left. Uh, it's been here for a while and um, a lot of them are going to the new stadium and it's good to see the, the old stadium here and um, and it been fixed up, obviously more people here. I think we had 75,000 people here the other night, which was an amazing thing. So perfect, and um, hopefully I'll see you all again soon.